You've heard the old saying it takes a village to raise a child for Miss Frances Scott, mother of Senator Tim Scott. It's more than a saying. It's a way of life, one that she's passionate about. Raising up the low country is helping single mothers rise to new levels. Raising Up the Low Country Foundation is a nonprofit organization based in Charleston committed to helping and supporting working single mothers. Ms. Frances Scott, the mother of U.S. Senator Tim Scott, founded the organization in 2017. The goal is to create healthy habits through coaching programs. The foundation focuses on fitness, finances, cooking, parenting, career and life skills, encouraging single moms as they move toward a better life for themselves and their children. Ms. Scott says nearly 100 women have gone through their programs offering a hand up. I know about it quite well because I raised two boys as a single mom and it's not an easy job. It's a very hard, difficult job. So that's one reason why I started the foundation, to really encourage, to motivate, and to let the single moms know that there's someone there that cares about you, love you, and support you, and also understand the journey that you're going through. They teach financial literacy classes. I've been to um, a homeowner's workshop. I've gone to the um, starting a, your small business workshop. So there's all sorts of avenues that they'll help you. They'll help you, you know, learn how to budget your money better and stuff like that. So you're not struggling every month. I love and enjoy the, the community aspect of it where single moms can get together and really just relate with each other and the struggles and the, the triumphs of, of being a single mom raising and some kids. They are definitely making a difference for every single mom in the low country. Ms. Scott is preparing for the foundation's annual fundraiser to keep the programs going. The Raising Up the Low Country Foundation annual fundraiser gala will be held tomorrow at the Cholson Place. Now coming up today at four, a closer look at the foundation and its impact.